Welcome to another video. In today's video, I'm going to talk about how you can get pretty much an infinite number of palace spheres. So, if you're starting off in the game, you need palace spheres too in order to catch the pals. And starting out, they can be a little bit uh, difficult to craft. Well, they're actually not too difficult. It's just kind of more of, of an annoyance because you're always going to run out and you need to keep on crafting them. But what you can actually do early on, and we're actually on the technology page. I have a lot of points I haven't spent yet because I'm just going to go through and spend them all here pretty soon. But you're going to need the ranch, which is going to be at level 5. I think it costs like 2 technology points as well. So you're going to get the ranch. Make sure you have like your base set up. And we're going to want these uh, pals called Vixie. Now, you can get about 4 or 5 of them, again, depending on your pal box uh, level and how many you put in there you want to make sure you have however many you can you want to have somebody that can then do transporting because you want to or you can just run around and pick them up but if you have a transporting then they can occasionally go through put them in the box and then you'll just get infinite number of pal spheres now the location of these uh pals is this would be the beginning where you start you're going to come down here this is where my base is you go down you're going to go to the left and you're going to go to the small settlement located right here on the map once you have made your way to the settlement location uh, make sure you grab uh, this fast travel uh, point here and then we're going to run up to the left up the stairs and a lot of times we're going to see some vixie spawn not every single time but at least 80% of the time you're going to get uh, two to three Vixies that will spawn up here. I should have my bow, but ran out of arrows. Need to make more arrows. There we go. We're going to capture. And yeah, so there's one over there. So there's actually about uh, the Kremis. There's a lot of those that spawn around here as well. But we're going to capture all those and just get as many as you can. Again, you can leave. Go to teleport, teleport to your base, or another teleport, teleport back, see see what kind of respawns. Okay, once we're back, you can then go to your management, put them to work, and as you can see, they're just going to get the power spheres for you. You can run over, let's go collect them. And there we go. We have 23 already, and they're just going to keep on going to work. So I have a little over 50 already, without even doing anything, by the way. Just, you got to collect them. Make sure they have a place to sleep, some food, and then they'll just keep on grazing. If you want to assign uh, one to the farm when it's grazing, or if it's not you know, doing that task, you can pick it up and then you can throw it in the farm and then it will say fixed assignment to ranch. So that's how you can assign a lot of your pals to anything. Also, this guy has uh, developed an eating disorder due to stress. So I'm, I'm going to have to look at that. And this is going to be the trait here which can be the partner skill to dig here sometimes it's with items from the ground when assigned to ranch that's why it is so good early on so yeah if you have any questions please feel free to comment them down below let me know how you guys are liking the game i've been really enjoying it lately and yeah make sure to like subscribe turn on those post notifications and i will see you guys in the next one